द डिफरेंट डिविजन्स इन फॉरेंसिक्स आर बायोलॉजी केमिस्ट्री टॉक्सिकोलॉजी डी एन ए फिंगर प्रिंटिंग फिंगर प्रिंट एंड क्वेश्चन डॉक्यूमेंट एंड मेनी मोर इन दिस डिफरेंट डिविजन्स देर आर न्यूमरस ऑफ इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स यूज फॉर द एनालिसिस सो लेट्स टॉक अबाउट द डिफरेंट इंस्ट्रूमेंटल टेक्निक्स यूज इन द फॉरेंसिक साइंस फील्ड हेलो गाइज आई एम तुषार अजरा माहिरे वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल तुषार ऑनलाइन फॉरेंसिक्स so without any delay let's explore the forensics so let's talk about the different instrumental techniques so as you can see here these are the different instrumental techniques which are used in the forensic science field starting with microscopy spectrometry naa that is neutron activation analysis x-ray and x-ray based techniques mass spectroscopy chromatographic techniques electrophoresis and immunoassays so these all techniques are included in the unit 2 of ugc net syllabus i will make separate video on each technique and on each instrument i have already made a video on one of the instrument which is gas chromatography this instrument comes under the chromatographic techniques so please watch that video for more information the link of that video is in description and on i button 2 microscopy so the microscopy is the basic yet important technique in forensic field microscopy is not only used in the field of forensic biology but also in the field of forensic physics fingerprint and question document for the analysis of physical evidences bullet comparison analysis of fingerprint and question document respectively so the different microscopes which we are going to study in our upcoming videos are compound microscope polarizing microscope comparison microscope stereo or stereoscopic microscope fluorescent microscope and electron microscopes one of the challenges in forensic evaluation is that the evidences has to be analyzed in non destructive manner so that the evidences should not destroy spectrometry has proven to be a non destructive technique used in forensic science field for the analysis of different bodily fluids as well as the other forensic materials like drugs pesticides toxicants and ink this technique allows the evidences to be preserved even after testing it so the different techniques are uv visible spectrometry that is ultraviolet visible spectrometry ir that is infrared spectrometry raman spectrometry atomic absorption spectrometry that is aas and flame emission spectrometry that is fes naa that is neutron activation analysis this technique is sensitive and multi elemental analysis technique used for the analysis of bullet gunshot residues and other crime scene materials like paint glass and metals this is non destructive technique with no or minimal sample preparation bulk analysis is done in this technique for the solid liquid suspensions semi solids and gases x ray and x ray based techniques are used for the characterization and elemental analysis of extensive variety of substances and are typically non destructive technique of analysis characteristics of each substance is to crystallize in particular crystal structure and have unique elemental structure giving rise to unique x-ray pattern these techniques are mostly used in the analysis of metals paint glass and other physical evidences which are found on crime scene so the different techniques named as x-ray diffraction that is xrd and x-ray fluorescence that is xrf mass spectroscopy so every compound has unique mass fragmentation in mass spectroscopy a sample is analyzed to determine its molecular composition through the spectrum that reveals the masses of its components fragment all types of components and evidences are analyzed in the mass spectroscopy this mass spectroscopy mainly used to analyze pesticides drugs paint and ink chromatographic techniques so the chromatography is a technique by which the mixture of components are separated 
This can be achieved by the properties of a components such as size and how compound reacts with the stationary and mobile phase of a chromatography. Chromatographic techniques are mainly used in the toxicology and chemistry division for the analysis of pesticides, drugs and toxicants. The various instruments in the category of chromatographic techniques are TLC that is thin layer chromatography then GC that is gas chromatography which is also known as GLC that is gas liquid chromatography then HPLC which means high performance or high pressure liquid chromatography and last one is HPTLC that is high performance thin layer chromatography. Hyphenated techniques. So the combination of chromatographic techniques and mass spectroscopy is called as hyphenated techniques. Chromatography produces pure or nearly pure fraction of chemical component in a mixture and mass spectroscopy produces selective information for the identification of particular compounds. So this hyphenated technique includes GCMS that is gas chromatography coupled with mass spectrometry, LCMS that is liquid chromatography coupled with mass spectrometry, IRMS that is infrared mass spectrometry and ICPMS that is inductively coupled plasma mass spectrometry. Electrophoresis The ability to separate proteins and other biological components mean that electrophoresis is popular in the field of forensics, particularly in the analysis of unknown samples. This technique is mainly used to separate and analyze protein in blood for DNA fingerprinting and DNA testing. The different techniques are high and low voltage electrophoresis and immunoelectrophoresis. And the last technique is immunoassays. So an immunoassay is a type of bioanalytical test where the detection of target compound or analyte is depends upon the specific antigen antibody reaction. So the application of immunoassays in forensics is their ability to detect the trace amount of drugs, other xenobiotics and their metabolites in physiological fluid and organs and their ability to detect explosive residues. This technique is also used in toxicological analysis. So this was all about the introduction to instrumental techniques which are used in forensic science field. Hope you have liked the video. If you haven't subscribed my channel, Please press the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to explore the forensics. Please comment your thoughts in comment box below. Like and share the video to your friends and family. We'll meet in the next video. Till then stay tuned to the TOF. Bye bye. Thank you.